This is the video which was called into question in the media yesterday. The video we allowed to be presented to the mayor's chief of staff several months ago. Now recall, the mayor has repeatedly claimed that he knew very little about this project, only open, quote, rumor and rumblings, close quote. When asked about the fact that his chief of staff is, was shown the video as a part of a briefing, the mayor has responded by saying that his chief of staff referred to the project as a, quote, cool downtown development, but lacking in detail in its location. Those are the questions we've been asking, close quote. As you watch this video, I would ask that you consider whether it's unclear as to where this development is proposed to be located. If we can accept that the mayor's own chief of staff conveyed to the mayor that the video did not clearly explain the nature and location of the project, my question to the mayor is whether he was similarly confused when he himself watched the video and saw the rendering in our offices, which just happened to overlook the two sites. The second question I would have for the mayor is why he has repeatedly alleged that they don't have all the details of our option agreement when he knows it was delivered to the city solicitor on December 1st under conditions that clearly allow it to be used by the city, its administration, and the mayor himself for the collective assessment and due diligence of our project. You're saying that the mayor saw this video and the drawings, Mr. Chipman? Yes, he did. When, when was that and where was that? He was a result of uh, um, an impromptu meeting that occurred at the end of a hockey game in November. I think it was the 18th. Um, he had invited uh, Kevin Chief to the game. Partway through the game, they advised me of their, uh, their presence at the game, and we met up afterwards. Um, chatted for a few minutes. Kevin had been aware of our desire to uh, do a project, but hadn't seen any of the details of it. We had just completed the video, or shortly before that time, I suggested I show it to them. So we, uh, we went up, up to our offices and uh, had a brief chat. I showed him the video, and uh, that's when he saw it. You say that, you're, that this is under reconsideration for the future uh, until such time he has reestablished trust. What does that, can you elaborate on that? You know what? It means we're going to pause and reflect, okay? It means we've been living for the past two weeks having been accused of doing something wrong. You've probably had that experience sometime along in your life. It's not fun, right? But that's life. But there comes a point in time where it perpetuates, you've got to say, you know what, enough, stop. We've got to pause here and really consider whether or not we can do a project of that magnitude in this environment. So that's what we're going to do. This is, these facts have been known by a lot of people for a long, long time, and to suggest it was done back room or privately or secretively, not as, is that offensive, it's just flat out false. I know this is asking you to speculate a little bit, but I'm indulge me and say, why? I why don't know. Sean, I honestly don't know. And, and that question has been asked by many people, including myself, over and over. Why? I don't understand. And I would have, I would have gladly conveyed um, our, our entire intention and, our, and every step that we've taken along the way. I, 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 you know, I, I, showing them the video was just a, 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 an act of saying, this is where we're at. This is new. Like, this is a, now we have something to show. And so to find out a couple months or a after the fact that, and, and presumably after people have had a time to process what it is we're doing, to allege that we've done something wrong is, is I, I don't understand, it's inexplicable to me.